Hi, this is Chris from Discovery Learning. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can elegantly display your digital learning content in a lightbox window inside of your Learn Dash lesson or topic page, whilst also being able to take advantage of the great features available in our Learn Dash lesson and topic progression plugin for Storyline and Captivate. To create my lightbox on screen, I am using a separate plugin called WP Video Lightbox, which is a free plugin available on the WordPress plugin repository. The great thing about this particular plugin is that as well as being able to open HTML content as an iframe, you can also lightbox video from sites like YouTube and Vimeo, as well as image and image galleries, so there are lots of features you can take advantage of when building your LearnDash course. With the plugin installed, I now need to head over to my LearnDash lesson or topic page where I want to display my content and create the link or button for the learner to click to launch the e-learning. In this case, I have created an image with a rollover state to act as an on-screen button. Now I will create my e-learning content and upload the files to my web server in order to get the HTML link to open. With regards to the JavaScript command needed to activate our plugin, the great thing is you don't need to change a thing, as this is exactly the same as the instructions you will find on our plugin store page. Now following the instructions of the WP Video Lightbox plugin, I just need to wrap my button image in an anchor tag with all of the values required to launch the iframe. You will see that there is a width and height option in order to open the content at the correct size depending on your publish settings. And before publishing the page, make sure you have ticked the Hide Mark Complete button checkbox in the Lesson Options meta box in order to activate our plugin in this page. Let's now take a look at the result on screen as a learner. So here I am in my course and I am on this particular lesson page. I will click to launch the e-learning content associated with this lesson. And as you can see, I have built a quick bubble pop game in Storyline to play and the JavaScript command will trigger when the player wins. Now if I go ahead and play the game, I get the congratulation message and a button to click which will activate my JavaScript command when I click it. And now we have moved on to the next lesson in the course. And as you can see here, the previous lesson we have just been on has been automatically marked complete by the Storyline game. And if I go back to the course overview page, you can see that it has worked here. We have two versions of our plugin available, both of which can be found on the Discover eLearning web store. Thanks for watching and good luck building your next level courses in LearnDash LMS.